I'm trying to tell you the setup. The setup. I talked to Holly, Linda, and, and I said Eric. Uh, Philip. Uh huh. Well, the setup and was Holly that. Holly and Linda say he's dead. No. Linda says he's dead. Wait, well, you won't let me finish telling you the setup. Eric First is David's call. brother. Yes. David and David and Veronica didn't make any mention of that. Yes, they are. Are they embarrassed? No, because they're all deeply involved and enmeshed in their own. Well, they're all brothers. Derek asked for help because David was doing nothing to crack this blackmail. And I thought if anybody could do anything, Eric can. So I went to Eric for help. One or two, you know, the police. They haven't found a thing over there. They, what's there to find? Ashes, you know? He's. Find his teeth. Listen, I've been in this business a lot longer than you have, and I know he's gone. There's, we didn't want him to find anything. We didn't want him to find our photographs. We wanted everything to be gone. I'm glad. How many other people is he charged? I, I usually don't have to kill people. I mean, it's not really my business, but what I did, no, I never killed people before. Well, what happened was in some cases, the blackmail wouldn't work because it would be the wrong person. The CIA would look like a fool. That's what happened in the case of the Egyptian ambassador. Why, do they, why does everybody claim that they Oh, am I supposed to tell him I told you? Oh, I have to go meet him at 10 o'clock and tell him now. Like a hotline crisis scale of Veronica's murder under their arms, the best kept I went to I went to his loft around 10, 10 of 10 last night. Set some arson charges in the basement, and I went up to confront him. And when I got up there, he was lying dead on the floor with a bullet through his head. Why did you want to? Why did you burn his body? Because I wanted to destroy the evidence. Carmen and I and Veronica had a, a, have been having this sort of three-way sex thing for a long time. That, um, well, as, um, you know, Carmen is a woman. Just yeah. Gigs. Oh, yeah, Carmen is a woman. Uh, you know, the only person David ever loved was his own five fingers. You know what drove his, his wife to, to, to being gay? You know, David used to jerk off all the time and leave his underpants around the, in the study and she'd have to clean it up. They've been there three, four weeks. They've been stuck to the wall. They've been stuck to the papers. That would, I, I, that is, I turn off to any woman. I don't care what she is. I don't care who she is. That is such a job. I found some pictures in a folder. In this folder were negatives and also some prints. Illicit, pornographic sex pictures. And in one of these pictures was a man I knew. Black me pictures like... One of our politicians with two 12-year-old boys making love. This in these pictures involved with young girls, and I'm not going to tell you what I saw. Um, it's we had to get rid of him. There's no, no question about it. And I'm so, you know how good I, you feel when you have done your mission, you fulfilled it. And the only thing is now... Uh,